So here we are, the Toledo, almost a full moon by the way, but uh, yeah, we're at the Toledo Ohio Supercharger. I'm gonna take a quick walk around. All right, so it's at a Meyer, and for you people, Meyer is, if you're not from the Midwest, you don't really know, but a Meyer uh, is essentially, look at this, it's, it's freaking my model, freaking X. It's just a big grocery store, but they have like clothing and stuff too. Uh, so from a vegan standpoint, uh, lots of options lots of options inside of Meyer. Uh, there's a Menards over there, so if you need some hardware stuff maybe uh, related to the vehicle or uh, maybe you have a project that you're doing or some other, something else you need. There's a Meyer gas station here. So can, Meyers are usually open. I think, that, I don't know if there's a single Meyer that's not open 24 hours, by the way. So, just wanted to add that. Uh, but anyway, uh, so across the street on the other side of this McDonald's over here, there's a Pilot, another gas station. There's also a Taco Bell and a Burger King. And Taco Bell is very vegan friendly if you're fine with some potential cross-contamination, uh, which is, or them just flat out messing up the order. Uh, there's an auto zone, uh, which is really useful. Uh, this is really close to the freeway actually too, within, within five minute drive, uh, half a mile, I would say. There's an, in the distance over there, there's an Aldi, uh, there's a car wash, uh, so that helps. So yeah, and there's some lodging for sure here. So there's lots of lodging. So from a vegan standpoint, there are plenty of options. This is one of the, this will probably be one of the better uh, supercharger stops that you'll uh, see in this whole kind of ordeal. So yeah, this is my very first supercharger stop. That footage, I took some footage in there to show kind of some of the, the junk food vegan options. You know, kind of the produce section, because that's usually where I shop. But you know, there's chips and things in there. Uh, there's a bathroom. Uh, it's it's not that far. I, it was it was probably a two minute walk or whatever, depending on how fast you walk. But uh, when I take this trip across the country here in in a month, two months really, maybe two and a half months, uh, you know, places like this are going to be imp going to be important, and they're going to really determine how much I bring with me. Like I have a cooler a 12 volt outlet cooler that i use in my old car even and i want to uh I'm, i'll use that still and i'm gonna bring stuff with me but like along the way i'm going to try to look and take notes because i'm gonna have to charge right like i'm gonna have to do you know at least 20 30 minutes maybe more of charging on this trip and along the way i'm gonna stop at these superchargers or other chargers uh, i'm probably gonna get a chatamo adapter those are really around here at least i don't know about the other other parts of the country uh but around here chatamo is real big at the dunkin donuts locations uh at the time of this filming so uh not many vegan friendly options i'm sure dunkin donuts and i don't really go to these places but i'm gonna go to these places and i'm gonna do the research i'm gonna do it uh, for the sake of um, the plant-based world. Uh, my friends at the Now You Know, uh, who are, whose referral code I use for this, by the way, uh, this Model X today, uh, those, my friends at the Now You Know, uh, well, new friends, they didn't even know I existed, even though I've watched their road trips and everything, uh, they always gave their uh, superchargers a rating. Uh, so I, I'm going to keep with that format just because I'll probably let them use these videos on their supercharger map too. So, I this supercharger from a vegan standpoint is a good solid nine out of ten. Now, why not a ten out of ten uh, from the vegan standpoint? Is there isn't like a quick eatery other than like a Taco Bell. Like if they had like some sort of specialty uh, vegan or plant-based restaurant right here, or there was multiple options maybe. I know it's my first one I've ever reviewing. I haven't really set a standard. I just thought of this on the way in here, actually, that I was going to uh, kind of actually do it. You know, actually, like maybe this will be part of my channel. You know, like let's just do it. So I'm giving this a nine. It's really close to the freeway. Uh, lots of food options. There is there are lodging options. Hey, there's gas if you need it. Uh, you know, if like your desperate need for you know anything auto repair related, the Meyer here has it. Uh, and there's the auto zone there and there's a Menards. So also another quick tip about Meyer and why you should support Meyer if you're a Tesla owner uh, specifically is Meyer and Tesla uh, there's a, there's a bunch of these superchargers at Meyers and part of that is uh, Meyer plans on purchasing 
uh, a bunch of the semi trucks. If you, I'll do. Maybe I'll add some links to some of the articles I've read. Yeah, they're in cahoots. Uh, they, they they support the sustainable future. Uh, they're based out of Grand Rapids, Michigan. The entire Meyer chain. Uh, Fred Meyer uh, is very well known around these parts and Grand Rapids especially. So yeah. So from a from a supercharger standpoint, this is probably a ten. Uh, it, it's got everything you need and like anything even the car wash is there uh, I think there's actually I see a post office there's a post office in the mire I mean there's there's probably literally anything you could need right around here so this is probably a 10 out of 10 for uh for the supercharger review from the vegan standpoint not at a 10 but yeah it it feels different like I feel different today uh it's it's a it's a liberation to some degree to take control and not be part of a different system you know, I've, I've eliminated myself from the entire meat and dairy industry, and now I'm eliminating myself a big part, like over 99%. Uh, you know, not, maybe not quite 100% because I'll probably rent cars. And I have friends, and like like I said in a previous video, uh, you know, any, any partner I may have in life may have a nice car, and I'm going to not necessarily just not let them fill up, or I, I'll do it for them. You know, like I'm not heartless, but... Uh, I'm, I'm part of a different world now. I'm part of this different club, in a way. It, it, it feels so good. I'm looking at this Meyer gas station, and there's a BP right there. I'm looking at these thinking, oh my god, like I never need to go there again until I need to go there again, you know? And the, the inhaling of the fossil fuel toxin, uh, I'll get it on the road, but I won't get it from the direct pump. You know, it's not going to be on my skin. It's going to be different. And different's good sometimes, you know? Especially if it's for a sustainable and great future. Uh, a cleaner future. That I think we all deserve. And we all should strive for. So, it's it's amazing. It's amazing. I, I, I want everyone uh, that maybe sees this, if you don't know already, you need to try. You need to get into an electric vehicle, whether it be the Bolt or Tesla or any of these new ones coming out, there's plenty. Uh, do it, experience it, and realize that this is the way things are going. This is what we should be doing. Thanks again, thanks for watching, and it's incredible. So yeah, peace.